Hi guys, we are back. Hello. Heather Hineker with Ascent Adaptation and Regeneration with one of my most favorite people in the world, Danielle Palmer of Daily Dose Wellness. You guys have heard me talk about her being my frequency guru. When it comes to frequency, honestly, I don't think there's anyone that can articulate it the way that Danielle can. Um, she's just so incredible and we're very, very lucky to have her in um, Ascent doing things with frequency. I mean, she's been doing frequency with her SkinR uh, microcurrent technology for how many years? 14. 14 years. <laughs> and now with the new introduction of the Tenant Biomodulator and Biotransducer, she's actually gotten trained. Her and Natalie have been trained in doing, and it's called a MEAD device. It stands for Meridian Energy Analysis Device. And it actually gives us a baseline of where someone is um, before they actually start before we even recommend you doing these types of treatments. We want to see where you're at. So I'm going to have Danielle kind of explain what a mead analysis looks like, how long it is, what she does during it, um, and we'll go from there. Yeah. <laughs> well, thank you. Um, so the mead, basically during one of these sessions, what we're going to do is uh, there's, there's two parts to this test. So the first one, we're going to be using a computer system, the MEAD. And basically what we're doing is we're measuring specific points along these meridians to see what your body's overall energy reading is. Um, meridians, I know a lot of people associate with Eastern medicine and, you know, they think that it's woo woo, but they've actually been proven to be a real thing a liquid crystalline structure in the body. So Western Med is finally catching on. <laughs> so what we do is basically we take a measurement along these points to find your body's overall energetic reading. And then in the second part of the test, we do a manual check to see which bioterminals or circuits, let's just say, are on and which ones are off. After that, we do a calculation to find what your body's exact voltage is. And then from there, the most important part is we actually go through and we figure out why these circuits are off in the first place. So we're going to be talking about things that have happened throughout your entire life. If you had an injury when you were a kid that shut off that circuit, and then all of a sudden, all of these health issues seem to line up exactly with that circuit. It can be quite, uh, quite uh, enlightening, let's just say. <laughs> 100%. But uh, yeah, so our goal is we want to get to the root of why these are off in the first place. That way we can understand how do we fix you? And that's with things like the biotransducer and biomodulator. Yeah, and I'll just hear a little quick um, personal note. So before we even decided to bring this into Ascent, um, I had an analysis with Danielle. And, you know, we're lucky if most of us are walking around between 20 and 25 millivolts. And I was around 19 and super disappointed in seeing that. But come <laughs> to find out that's it's actually one of the better ones. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> which is so scary. Um, and then after doing this for a couple months, two times a week, we were actually able to see a shift, an upshift to 28.9, which is probably one of the higher. It's really that, high. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and so to me, it really opened my eyes of, wow, I mean, we're doing so many other things that are, are affecting us on a cellular level with the different systems of the body and different parts of the cell. But this is truly the only one that I've seen that raises the voltage to the degree that it is. And then what we want to start doing is um, Danielle and I are going to actually start doing consults together when people come in where you know we'll get on the the in-body 770 and figure out what the phase angle is and the levels of systemic inflammation so we have that baseline and then we can get the baseline of where the voltage is and everything and her and I work so great together and I'm just really excited to be teaming up and trying to help you guys so thank you so much for listening and we will see you soon thank you bye <laughs>